Welcome to Papiete in Tahiti. It's 8.30 in the morning and it's already hotting up. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day here. Tahiti is a beautiful island with amazing sunsets, ideal for a romantic honeymoon with its stunning mountains and white sand beaches. If you're on a cruise, once you've visited the market in Papiete, my advice would be to head for a resort. We visited the Manava Suites Resort, just a short drive, only 12 kilometers away from the port. A taxi takes about 20 minutes. Grab one from the rack behind the market. It's cheaper, ours costs $25. Tahiti gets a lot of rain, and that's reflected in the lush vegetation. The gardens are green and relaxing, and ideal for a pleasant stroll in the shade. But the most outstanding feature of the hotel is the infinity pool, with its stunning view of Morea Island. If I had longer, I would learn to paddleboard. The sea is so calm and the turquoise water so inviting. We saw a man and his dog on a paddleboard, apparently a regular occurrence, as he travels to and from work every day. The Manava Suite Resort has a daily fee of $100, and for that you get lunch and use of the facilities. We stayed a couple of nights at the end of our cruise. The rooms are pleasant, clean and spacious, and the bed was very comfortable, although the wardrobe space is small. Maybe take some extra hangers. There's a fridge, a safe, and a nice bathroom with a bath, shower, and double sinks. There's also a hairdryer in the cupboard under the sink. There's a very expensive restaurant and a bar which is very soulless but there are more options which are much more fun just down the road. There are cheaper places to eat in Tahiti than the very expensive hotels and we're going to try these food trucks. Street food is going to cost you between $12 and $16 for steak and chips or fish and chips. This is where the locals eat. Perfectly cooked fish, possibly a few too many chips but it's delicious. The view at sunset is stunning and it's still plenty warm enough to enjoy a beer at the Swim Up Bar. The service and reception is very friendly, although if you want to know about local buses or the area, you do have to do a bit of research yourself. Register with us here at Doris Visits and we will try to do our bit as travel video bloggers, where you can look before you book and see the cruise before you cruise the sea. Facebook, Twitter and online. Just search Doris Visits, then follow and share.